we have Stefan James here who is wearing a maple leaf colored tuxedo yeah, you know, supporting too. Toronto. A little ode to, to Canada. Yeah, yeah, a little ode to Canada. Now you were in Beale Street, which yeah. is amazing. Tell us a little bit about how you got that part, why it was important to you. Oh man, you know, I've been such a big fan of Barry Jenkins for a long, long time. And uh, and it's just so funny, you, you find out that he's making this film, uh, you find out that it's a James Baldwin adaptation, and then you just beg to be a part of it. So that was sort of the steps that, that we took. And uh, I'm so happy that Barry believed in me and, and trusted me with the opportunity. Do you remember your audition for this role? How nervous were you walking into the room? Yeah, you know what's crazy is I did a self-tape. Uh, so that eases the nerves a little bit. But I had lunch with Barry for the first time after sending him that self-tape. And that was a little nerve-wracking. So how'd you get through it? And tell oh us what man. you ate. Um, I think I took a shot of vodka right before we sat down. Just, <laughs> just to calm Don't my nerves. Don't try that at home. <laughs> but don't do that at home. Um, but it was awesome. He's so cool, and it gave me no reason to feel nervous at all. Now, let's talk about this tuxedo. Yeah. We love that men are deciding to bring it on the red carpet you today. Guys, we, we can't let the ladies show us up all the time, right? No you got to bring a little something, something. Well, I don't know if I could pull that off, but I love the pin, too. Look at that. Oh, thank you. Well, that is God, amazing. Yeah, yeah, so, so, one of the things I wanted to ask you is you're an artist in the film. You're yeah. a sculptor. You yeah. work with wood. Did you get to sort of do that yourself? Are those your pieces? Did absolutely, you learn? Absolutely, absolutely. I had a great, great um, teacher who uh, who showed me how to sculpt with wood and, and, and showed me how to sculpt with, um, you know, tools, chisels, if you will, that were from the 70s. Wow. So it's, it's wood carving uh, today is much different than wood carving in the, in the 60s and 70s.